Welcome back to Contra Valley Live. We have Matt Drake here, and he's going to tell us a little bit about the Henry Cho Show. So welcome here. Thank you. Tell us what's going on. Well, as, as you probably know, I'm the voice of 101.1 The Bull, and we've got a show coming to town, the Henry Cho Comedy Show with Ron Hortman as the opening act, taking place at May 7th at the McNeese Auditorium, or Convention Center, I'm sorry. Um, tickets are on sale right now through Stubwire, and we just want to bring some laughter to the valley and get back out and, and start living a little bit. We need that. After the year we've had, we all need a little bit of comedy, a little bit of fun. Is this the first time the Henry uh, Cho Show is in San Angelo? It's the first time Henry's come to town. He's uh, gained fame through having his own TV shows and Netflix specials. He just played the Grand Old Opry last weekend, and uh, it's, it's going to be a great time. He's very funny, and it's a PG-13 show. So bring your children, family friendly, and uh, there'll be no vulgarity or anything like that. That was my next question. Yeah. <laughs> Give us a little rundown. What can people expect from the show? Uh, very clean humor. Henry's been around. He was uh, on Johnny Carson back when Johnny Carson was still on the air and um, been with the Blue Collar Comedy Tour with Jeff Foxworthy and, and those guys. So he's a big name. He's excited to come to San Angelo. Um, in fact, I just spoke to him about 20 minutes ago before we came in the doors here. and. He's super pumped. It's going to be a great time. There'll be uh, food and drinks, and like I said, no vulgarity, no profanity. It's it's going to be a clean, nice night. And you just talked to him 20 minutes ago. How is he? Is he excited, nervous, ready to come to San he's Angelo? He's out playing golf right now, to be <laughs> honest with you. Yeah, he's, he's, he's actually extremely excited. He hasn't been to West Texas um, in a very long time. He said last, probably last decade, so he's excited to get out here. He's, he's born and raised in Tennessee, and that's where he lives. Um, he's, he's, he's known as the Southern Korean with the Southern voice, and that's how he promotes himself, and he's, he's a fantastic guy. He'll be a lot of fun. So he'll fit in perfectly he, here. He will. What does it take to put a show like this together? A lot of planning and a lot of people that get behind us. Um, Ultimate Air, 101.1 The Bowl, The Gin and Granary Steakhouse, um, Complete Car Care, all these people come together and uh, help us put on the events. They're not cheap to do, obviously, and... Uh, but the reward is is bringing something fun to the valley and there's a lot of preparations a lot of planning backline transportation and it's beneficial to our community it puts people in hotels and makes people come into town and spend so it's good all the way around definitely good for the community good for him good for you absolutely and give us your perspective what are you most excited for i'm mo most excited we did a concert two years ago here called rock the river fest um i'm excited to see people out and enjoying life again and, and getting back to feeling somewhat of normal and getting around each other and and camaraderie um, we've got a concert coming up June 11th which is the Aaron Watson concert with State Line Band and Morgan Miles um, Morgan Miles just won Nashville Recording Artist of the Year Aaron just won Entertainer of the Year in Texas and State Line Band just won Best New Band in Texas so um, that's June 11th at the River Stage it's just about having fun and getting out there and feeling good again that's exactly it. We have some big names coming to Absolutely. our community, which is really special, and it is good for the whole family, you said. It is. Family fun. I'm, I'm a dad. I want some place where I can take my kids and not worry about what, what's going to be said. What do they have to say about it? Are they ready to get out They're there, too? They're pumped. They, can, they can't be more excited. My eight-year-old has been watching Henry Cho on YouTube and getting the act down. I think he's, uh, he's going to try to beat him out on the stage, so we'll see how that goes. <laughs> That'll be fun, and I'm sure everybody listening is equally as excited. Can you tell us where we can get more information? You can get more information right now by calling 325-227-3235 or visit stubwire.com or by listening to 101.1 The Bull. We'll have a lot of details on there as well. You heard him and you know his voice. That is Matt Drake and we will be right back with more Contra Valley Live.